We're into a shots fired call. In a situation like this, every second counts. Everett police are responding to reports of an armed man in a crowded apartment building. Police open the door. But this is what it took for Officer Shane Nelson to reach the scene, weaving around drivers, creating a hazard on busy city streets. That person's just stopped right in the middle of the road. Luckily, no one here was hurt and the situation ended peacefully. Drivers who see emergency lights behind them are supposed to pull to the side and stop. I'll get people that I'll turn on my lights and sirens and they'll drive five, six, seven blocks and then finally pull into a spot. Can your car move at all? A trooper's dash camera was on as he reached a crash on an icy State Route 16 last year. Within minutes, a driver who did not move over slid into the patrol car. Then, a motorcyclist spun out of control and the trooper was hit again. This is our office. This is this is our work area. The state's move over law took effect two years ago. Highway drivers must now pull one lane over from an emergency when they can or face a hundred and ninety dollar fine. Still 430 Washington drivers were ticketed in 2013 and there were 23 shoulder crashes. Every time one of us is taken off the road or a firefighter is taken off the road or somebody, that impairs our ability to get traffic moving safely. In Linwood, I'm Lee Stoll, Cairo 7 Eyewitness News.